for another evenly matched game with TCU and Kansas State. Uh, TCU, a two-point favorite on the neutral floor in Kansas City. The total is 147.5. This one coming here on Thursday night for a slot in the semifinals. Kyle Hunter, a thought or two here? Yeah, this game is a very, very difficult handicap. I'm going to try my best to handicap this one, but I'm going to say, TJ, I went down a rabbit hole for the second time looking at this game. Um, Eddie Lampkin not going to play here for TCU. Um, I saw he stepped away from the team, and now I'm reading uh, alleged abuse by the coach, verbal verbal abuse. Um, not wow. a great situation. Uh, this is a key player for this team. You know, he's down there in the paint getting a ton of boards. Uh, really good player, Eddie Lampkin. Um, verbal abuse, uh, steps away from the team. Uh, that's not a great situation to go into. I like TCU as a team. They do need Lampkin down there. Um, TCU is the team I thought would have some value from a future standpoint, but you know, when you say I'm stepping away from the team, verbal abuse, I'm wondering if you're even coming back, uh, let alone not, not playing for this game. Uh, so I don't know that TCU has the same upside that they would have had. And, and this one, uh, Tang has done such a great job with, uh, Kansas state, um, Kansas state's pushed the tempo more than anybody else in the big 12. Uh, this is a team that has played different than most of the other teams in the Big 12. This is a Kansas State team that nobody could have dreamed would be 23-8 and eight on the season. I mean, they've been fantastic, one of the biggest surprises in college basketball. When these two played in the regular season, 82-68 win for TCU at TCU, 82-61 win for Kansas State. So neither game was particularly close. Um, tough handicap, TJ. I, I have to say, of all the games that we're talking about today, I think this is the game that I'd like to bet the least. Um, any lean on this one? I guess Kansas State, based on the situation that TCU comes into here. Uh, again, for these two, I'm just looking at their most recent uh, matchups here. Uh, they played last in Manhattan, and Kansas State Blew them out, 82-61. I'm looking for the earlier matchup in Fort Worth. That was a TCU win by 14. Mike Miles is a big key for TCU as the guard, uh, along with Keontae Johnson, who's the great story, the the kid that had, uh, obviously, the collapse and the cardiac arrest at Florida. Uh, he, He obviously got much better, took more than a year off from the game, transferred to Kansas State. Keontae Johnson, uh, arguably comeback player of the year situation nationally, 18 points per game. All right, so neutral floor. This is the last game on the court of the four games Thursday night late, somewhere around 9.30 Eastern time uh, in this matchup. Split in the regular season. Uh, Somebody was asking philosophically, just give me a handicapping opinion, when the line is this low on a neutral floor, like minus two, minus one and a half, are you just better to play the money line for the better value? Because basically at a point and a half or two, you're just looking for the win. Is it philosophically, what is your thought on that short one and a half or two point favorite versus the money line neutral floor college tournament games? You know, uh, TJ, I don't like paying that extra juice to pay for the money line. I mean, you're paying minus 125, minus 130. Uh, you know, it's hard enough to win 55% of your bets uh, to start with. I think when you start laying that much juice and you have to have. Uh, you know, the break even's not 52.38% anymore. It's quite a bit higher. I know it feels better to have the money line because you're going to lose some of those games by the hook. But I think long term, it's it's dangerous to be uh, laying that kind of juice. So, I, no, I don't really like to do that. All right. Good enough. Thank you for the opinion there. Again, the TCU Kansas State winner gets the winner of Texas and Oklahoma State in the semifinals on Friday night. Big 12 tournament. Key- Thank you.